There are very stunning luxury yachts in the world today where some are made in the current years while others still look as cutting edge as the day they were made. Here are our favorite yachts and why they will capture the hearts of many for decades to come. Before we continue, if you are new to the channel, welcome! This is New World Tech. We would appreciate it if you would subscribe to the channel and let's get you going with some of the best tech content you can think of. Let's continue with what we have for you today. Olivia O is an amazing super yacht built in Norway and delivered in 2020. This is a super yacht with amazing exterior styling and great interior features that span six decks and makes a statement the moment guests and visitors set foot on the generous swim platform and climb one of the two sweeping staircases to the yacht's tail. Most of this outdoor area is exposed to the elements, and guests can swim in the pool, soak in the jacuzzi under the moonlight, and rest on the sunbeds after a large lunch and a cocktail or two from the wet bar. Olivia O's vessel includes seven guest cabins that can host up to 14 guests. A further 30 crew members can find space in 15 cabins below the deck. The yacht has a large movie theater, a gym, as well as a beauty salon. The ascending decks provide an alfresco dining area, a private owner's deck with a jacuzzi and sun pads, plus a helipad on the bridge deck that, when empty, can be used as an observation deck. Olivia O Yacht is the 88th largest yacht in the world with a total length of 88 meters, and due to her high draft, she is not suitable for shallow waters but rather designed for exploration and more remote journeys. Thanks to her twin electric Rolls-Royce engines, the Olivia O cruises at a speed of 14 knots. She is owned by Ayal Ofer, a Monaco-based billionaire who is active in shipping and real estate. Motor Yacht A Motor Yacht A is a super yacht designed by Philip Stark and engineered by naval architect Martin Francis. It was built in Kiel by the Blom & Voss shipyard and delivered in 2008 at a rumored cost of $300 million US. This mega yacht that measures 119 meters with almost 6,000 tons is owned by a Russian entrepreneur and industrialist, Andrei Melnichenko. It was the sixth largest yacht in the world at the time of its launch in 2008, and today it's in the top 30. She features an exterior design by Philip Stark that turned heads from the moment of its conception, leading to descriptions of her as sleek and futuristic. The accommodation sleeps 14 guests across seven in-suite cabins, along with a crew of 37 and an additional staff of five. Security is tightly controlled, with 44mm thick bomb-proof glass in the windows, over 40 CCTV cameras, motion sensors, biometric fingerprint or keypad entry for restricted areas, and a rumored escape pod in case of emergencies. Overall, Mega Yacht A is impressive. Adastra Adastra is a trimaran-type super yacht built in 2012 by McConaughey and designed by UK-based John Shuttleworth Yacht Designs. This beautiful super yacht has an exceptionally low fuel consumption and yet boasts excellent sea-keeping qualities and luxurious accommodations. The multi-award-winning 42.5 meters motor yacht Adastra accommodates up to six guests in three in-suite cabins for an intimate cruising experience with close family and friends, all served by a professional crew of five throughout each trip. The hulls of the yacht are formed from e-glass, while the deck and superstructure are made of carbon fiber and Nomex honeycomb core. These features make Adastra incredibly lightweight, weighing just 49 tons before water and fuel. Almost all elements of the craft are custom-built, including carbon fiber ladders, hatches, and port lights. A unique anchoring system means all three of her anchors are driven by carbon fiber drum winches operated by hydraulics. The main deck accommodates a saloon which encompasses a lounge area, dining table, and navigation station. It provides views of the ocean through a window. The sunbed is on the foredeck while the aft deck has a sofa and bar area and dining area. She has a single Caterpillar C18 1150 horsepower engine at 2,300 RPM and two Yanmar 110 horsepower outrigger engines rated at 3,200 RPM. Her vessel features an Alpha Lavelle fuel cleaning system for cleaning the engine. She received the 2013 World Super Yacht Award for most innovative design and was listed for sale in 2019. Crazy Me 
Crazy Me is a 50-meter luxury yacht built in the Netherlands by Heeson Yachts and delivered in 2013. Her top speed is 21 knots and her cruising speed is 18 knots. She can accommodate up to 12 guests in six staterooms with nine crew members waiting on their every need. Her interior has many great features such as 2.2 meter high windows in the upper saloon, a custom built audio visual system, and a pool with jets to swim against the current which can be covered to become a dance floor. Stella del Sud When it comes to luxury, this stunning super yacht will blow your mind away. She is designed by Gabriel Teruzzi Yachts and Design and has a lavish vessel built in the image of Cartier's rare 128 karat diamond. She has a price tag of $110 million. This new 110-meter yacht is all things nice. It features a helipad, a movie theater, and eight VIP guest cabins. Up to 18 guests can be accommodated across nine luxurious cabins. From the outside, the yacht looks like a diamond with a spectacular side window glass design that connects all decks. It is positioned to reflect the light so that the yacht sparkles continuously just like a diamond. Inside Del Sud's main saloon are panoramic windows. There's also a full beam wellness area that comprises a beauty and massage room, a gym, a sauna, and a steam room. There is a multifunctional room called the Aqua Room, which offers an American-style bar, a jacuzzi, and relaxing beds, plus an aquarium that has been built into the ceiling of the bed of the owner's cabin. Isn't it dreamlike? There you go. These are some of our favorite yachts that managed to snatch our hearts. What are your thoughts about them? We would love to hear your thoughts, so please share them in the comments below. Don't forget to give the video a like and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video.